and welcome back to a new video today i have with me the new hyundai tucson the diesel version 1.6 liter 136 horsepower and today it's all about driving we will drive this car i will give you my feedback on how it's feeling to drive also all the engines today on on hyundai tucson come with this 48 volt battery mild hybrid battery and this system will help the car uh, to accelerate consume less to have a uh, better co2 consumption and all about that we will talk in this video also if you are from switzerland or around switzerland guys you can come here at parisiautomobile.ch you can check out the cars they have great price discounts and they are super nice super service but enough about that guys uh, first of all i want to show you the car a little bit on the exterior uh, so you can make an idea it's a beautiful beautiful red in my opinion it fits really good i don't know this car really look uh, amazing on every color and you can see this is a kind of a, a bright red and we have another red here kind of a dark red on Tucson but the car look really good on on every color of course maybe you see the other review guys I have on my channel uh, review with the car interior exterior if you want to see it check it out on my channel also this uh, this is the vertex version it's kind of the full option uh, four wheel drive all track uh, this is maximum what you can buy uh, in terms of diesel so it has all that great option four-wheel drive uh, LED lights uh, adaptive cruise control you will see in the interior as well also it has a beautiful beautiful design uh, I like very much um, the, the exterior design of the car it's very similar with other engines yeah uh, I think we will go inside now uh, it comes also with 360 degrees camera and all that system but uh, about all that system guys if you want to find out more information about the car just check out the full review there you find uh, interior exterior the quality materials the space in the back and and information about that in this video it's all about driving so uh, let's drive guys and let's see how is to drive this car all right guys so let's drive the car also by the way the car come also with uh lock and unlock button all you have to do is just have the key in your pocket and you can lock and unlock the car by pressing this button here also it comes with folding mirrors electrically folding mirrors let's go inside guys i have to tell you this is the key by the way um if you didn't see it yet it's here all you have to do is just have it with you it doesn't matter where you hold the key what i want to tell you guys is that 
being inside here for the first time it feels really really high quality i tell you guys i drive the car before if you didn't see my other video check it out uh the petrol engine the the hybrid uh version of the car you can check out on my channel i have full review test drives all you want to find you find it on my channel but every time i come inside this new hyundai tucson i feel really special guys i tell you you have to test this car because when you are inside here you will understand what i mean i can uh through the video i can transmit i can send you this feeling uh on on how is to be inside here this dashboard the way they combine the doors there are phenomenal 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 interior anyway press the brake start engine button it's here close to the steering wheel and the engine it's on here as i said before we have the diesel version 1.6 liter uh diesel 136 horsepower the same digital cockpit uh the same multimedia system everything is the same here it comes with 360 degrees camera press this button and you can see right there you can see 360 degrees what it's around the car uh, if you go in reverse press the brake here you have the shift by wire transmission reverse neutral drive it's it's amazing i mean this is from the future hyundai makes such an amazing car i am always impressed when i come back inside uh, this tucson go in reverse and you can see right now you are in reverse and driving in reverse you can see how cool the car will map the ground i don't know if you can see it right now if you want to park the car you can see how easy it is to park it guys it will get you directly on the spot so it's super super easy to park this car uh this is just a demonstration for the purpose but it's it's insanely nice then press the brake press the drive now you're in the drive also it has a forward camera so you can see in the forward camera without any problem what it's forward also when you turn the signal left or turn the signal right you will see a camera here on the screen uh, something like the blind spot view it's calling uh, it's something that you never find on other cars model so that's something to keep in mind let's drive guys the same nice feeling um, what I'm interested to see in this test drive it is um, it is the way the engine feels wh while you're driving let me go in reverse one more time and you can hear a little bit the engine right now all right put it in drive and let's drive guys uh what interest what it's interesting in this video is to see how is the sound insulation and how is the engine doing with this mild hybrid system because it has a 48 volt battery that help uh the the diesel engine uh when you accelerate when you're coasting uh start stop system begin at 30 km per hour for example right now if you take the foot auto acceleration it comes stop it will stop the diesel engine and it will work only in a electric mode uh, it has a 0 0.44 kilowatt hour battery it's a small one also uh, the electric motor it has a small starter i should say starter it has 55 newton meters so it helps also uh, the diesel engine to get better um, acceleration better torque and also it helps the consumption you will have also less co2 hyundai claim that you will have seven percent less co2 uh, when you have this mild hybrid uh, system uh, than the normal conventional diesel engine so that's that's a great plus for the car um, the driving feeling it's very similar with uh, the other uh, versions so i mean the the suspension are great visibility also as i said before in other videos it's it's perfectly also great mirrors they they did really a great job you have the perfect visibility in this car also the acceleration is not bad you can feel a little bit of torque um now it's it's a really pleasant i forget to tell you guys that the car come also with electronic handbrake auto hold 
uh, also from here you can change different driving mode you have normal mode sport mode you can see the cockpit is changing echo mode right now we are driving in echo mode just a little bit so we can we can get the feeling of, of echo mode so the gear will change a little bit faster smoother so it will give you the best consumption in in the in the right time the brakes are smooth and nice also on the curves it stay really good i like very much when you turn the signals doesn't matter at what speed you are it will show you that camera on the cockpit i think you can see it pretty well right there so it's just super nice also as i said right now the acceleration it's pretty smooth and nice nice and smooth acceleration also the the suspension the way it stay on the road on the curves here for example it is really good nice and now at low speed at 50 it's it's quite silent that that was i think right now it's kicking a little bit the the starter the small electric motor so it help a little bit the engine because i cannot hear it anymore in this moment so it's kind of deactivate the diesel engine in this moment also the brakes are, are super super good super smooth when you press the the pedals they are smooth they are they are quite quite nice um you have ventilated seat, heated seats, heated steering wheel. You have so many options in this too. So I think if you want to buy a Mercedes in this price, you will pay double for sure. Climatic system, it's here easy to adjust. The, the Also this multimedia system, it's perfectly placed here. Um, I also make a video about that. Check it out on my channel, guys. I have there the video if you are interested to see. Uh, the multimedia system I have a full video with cockpit and multimedia system and also with Android Auto how to connect it check it out on my channel there you will find more information about that but overall uh, the steering wheel it's it's great the grip the, the quality of the steering wheel it's amazing um, I like it very much to be honest also let's change the driving mode guys from here we change we go in normal mode we see right now in normal mode yes the acceleration it's a little bit more aggressive so you can feel um, a little bit more power when you press the acceleration I can feel that that even the gearbox is changing a little bit later Of course the car come with with lane assist and adaptive cruise control and all that um, settings you can set it from here you have a button for the lane assist so you can activate the lane assist the autopilot uh, the adaptive cruise control the distance from you and the car in front you can set up from here from the from the left side You can see right now I just set it up and the car will, will hold between the lanes, will hold the steering wheel and then Hyundai did a great job in the last time. But I tested before and it's 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 great. Also here on the roundabout is doing a great job. It stay very good on the road, on the curves. It's it's impressive. Also the car come with this four-wheel drive system, but it's it's super impressive how good it stay on the road it's very responsive it feels quite sporty and you can hear now it's changing really fast really later let's go in sport mode you can see even the cockpit it's a little bit more red right now and we can decelerate a little bit so we can see the acceleration um, because right here is nobody on the on the street so you can Oh yes, quite nice, quite nice. Now it's, you have more torque um, in a sport mode. You can hear the engine RPM are going a little bit uh, upper and then just change a little bit later. 
it is indeed impressive um, how well they, they create this system um, it has also vectoring torque this uh, hash track uh, system the new four-wheel drive system uh, is just insanely good they manage to to control every wheel independently so it will give you the best uh, grip the best control over the vehicle so um, yeah indeed Hyundai did did a really good job pretty simple to set up here for example if we want to set up the speed let me it's like that 43 and the car will keep the the speed for you and now you can see it's the I take out the foot the engine it's already stop I think you can hear it before you stop it stops uh, it has this system uh, if you have under 30 km per hour and you go slowly to the stop signs then the engine the diesel engine will stop and it, it will work only with uh, with an electric kind of uh, will help you stop and, and reduce the, the consumption reduce the co2 but the quality, the build quality inside the car, it's insanely good. The feeling when you drive, when you take those bumps, it's very, very good. Um, I'm, I'm very impressed with, with the way it feels. And right now, if you set the speed, guys, let me set the speed, just like that, set it to 50. And you can see the car can keep it in the lanes let me go a little bit faster because here we have 80 nobody behind but still and you know the car will keep the, the the speed right now and will keep you between the lanes and what it's impressive it's that the car stay really between the lanes and that's really impressive uh it's the same as as tesla i should say i'm i'm quite impressed how good it stay between the lane it tell me put the hand on the steering wheel right now give me a warning and i will put it decelerate and it's it's quite 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 nice now I'm surprised here on the curves how good it stay on the curves when you take those curves how dynamic is the car it's it's super dynamic super um, agile I should say it feels quite agile here we can test the the turning radius for example and 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 then it's it's quite good it's quite quite good and and I'm super impressed how well the car is doing over those bumps. Now we can try a little bit of acceleration. From zero, for example. nice nice it's doing a great job and and the brakes are just just insanely good i like it i like the way it feels really really great car hyundai i really appreciate what you did in the last years with those cars and so easy to to, to take the curve so easy to come in super nice let's go in echo mode back this is my favorite mode echo mode that that the way we should all drive man i mean it's it's just the way we should all go silent nice smooth slow and steady i love that i love the feeling i like the cockpit the visibility is perfect really perfect um i'm 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 impressed with what what they did because they managed to integrate those um, digital cockpit uh, multimedia system they managed to add a lot of soft material here over the the dash the that dash it's flat like from the future guys I mean look at the dash it's flat it's nice you have amazing visibility you have these huge mirrors outside 
uh, where you can see perfectly what it's inside even on this mirror here I don't know if you can see it from there but you have amazing visibility even in the back there you have this glass roof with a lot of light coming inside beautiful quality those seats are amazing amazing quality you have side support they are wide enough um, smooth and nice I feel super super comfy on those seats to be honest uh, it's really really impressive how how comfortable is this car I think we will all miss this sound this diesel sound we will in 10 years we will never heard um, those this diesel diesel sound and yeah we have to enjoy it right now while we can and guys if you need an SUV and you drive many kilometers um, and you need to save more uh, money I think the diesel you need a lot of range I think this diesel version it's it's one of the the, the way you should go uh, because it's just just impressive I should say that that this new Hyundai Tucson 2021 model or 22 model in America in North America I think it's 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 probably in the first three the best SUVs um, in, in this year and probably in the next year um, and I'm not saying just like that I mean you just go and test it guys you know I know you complain all the time I always talk nice about cars but if I have to find um, a downside to this car probably will be I don't know the lights there down there the bulb light in the back for the turning signals so the, the only downside I find it in this car other than that is just perfect interior exterior the seats are comfortable you have USB port you have Android Auto all the new systems technology um, you have all you need the cockpit is digital multimedia system um, yeah it's fancy interior is new and fancy you have soft material everywhere on the doors uh, on the handle it's, it's just just insanely insanely good um, it's, it's quite good anyway even the steering wheel has such a good grip and then such a good uh, uh, quality even those buttons here look modern and nice you have pedals here if you want to have some fun in manual mode so you can change the gears manually um, the brakes are great the visibility it's great the sound insulation you can hear nothing from outside actually you can hear just the diesel engine uh, that why if you want to have more silent inside the car I recommend you to go with the petrol engine because the petrol engine will give you more silent will give you uh, less vibration inside and and uh, a little bit of peace of mind but anyway other than that guys it is it is insanely good also if you want to find out more information about this car guys uh, if you want to see the full review you just check it out on my channel um, I have already there the review I have the 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 test drive with the petrol and hybrid version so I know you're you're interested to see that those two um, because those are really indeed um, good option if you want a petrol or a hybrid version um, put it in a park electronic handbrake auto hold here are the, the driving modes from where you can change it also you have the button for lock you can lock the four-wheel drive of course when you go off-road and start the car stop the car and that was the test drive guys I hope you make an idea I hope you, you get some useful information from this video uh, as a conclusion the diesel uh, version it's a great option if you drive many kilometers every year if you need more range so you make longer trips from from one time and you need to save more money you know because the diesel will consume less energy and um, yeah actually let me see how much was the consumption look at this and the last 10 kilometers 7.2 liter consumption yeah it's not super 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 good and the last 10 kilometer 9.7 yeah of course the car is brand new it's a brand new car but 
yeah I don't know it's brand new so you cannot make an idea you have to drive much more on the highway of course you get much better consumption than a petrol car for sure um, but on the short trips here and there slow fast acceleration you will not make an idea on how will be the consumption but in my opinion I really recommend you to go to the petrol version to the hybrid version even more and and um, in the future, I think in a few months, will come out also the plug-in version of this new Tucson. The plug-in version, I totally recommend you, and I wait. I'm really excited to test it. Uh, you will have both from the from the both worlds. You can drive electric, you can drive with petrol. You have range, you have everything you need. So that will be a really interesting car. Uh, until then guys really appreciate that you're watching my videos thank you very much for watching guys if you find it useful give me a like um, share that i would really appreciate don't forget to subscribe to see the new notification when a new video come out for example the new hyundai plug-in hybrid will come soon also the hyundai ionic 5 electric will come on the channel soon so uh, just click the subscribe button to see the notification when all those new videos will come out if you have question I answer to all of you just please write me anything uh, I'm, I'm really reading your comments thank you very much guys again um, if you like the music in the video you have the link in the description um, also don't forget to check out our new website sdadancar.com there you find all the information about the car about the auto industry and news and stuff like that uh, so thank you very much for watching stay safe guys and see you soon in the next one bye guys